Good evening to all anglers out there. Welcome to 4Anglers, the digital platform that keeps fishing alive. It is great this evening to have somebody a little bit more internal to our organization, um, but not only a tech guy that knows a lot about systems and a lot about fishing, but also an avid bass angler um, who was the real kickoff of the Bass Angler magazine when we started that. And um, he's also a guy that has spent a lot of time on the water. We would like to uh, welcome Duncan Murphin. Duncan, it's great to have you here tonight. Evening, it's great to be here. Evening to all the viewers. Uh, Duncan, uh, you must be feeling a little bit locked down in the last couple of days. Not on the water, no bass, no nothing. Yes, sir. The past few days with the warming trends we've been having after these one or two cold snaps. I know those fish are biting out there and I'm really uh, from our lockdown and at home staring over we've got a, a pond across the way from us and uh, looking at the fish turning in the afternoon knowing that uh, there's some good fishing ahead once this is all passed. So you haven't sneaked away there yet? No, not yet. <laughs> <laughs> Duncan, you, you spent a lot of time on the water bass fishing. Um, what's your favorite? Uh, where would you like to go? If you can get out now and go wherever you want, which pond will you visit? So hands down, it must be Albert Falls. Uh, yeah. In my opinion, it's the best fishery in the country right now. Probably the best place to catch a 10 pounder or more than a 10 pounder on any given cost. And I know with uh, the reduced pressure, you could probably go anywhere and uh, call your shots, fish whatever you want, throw top water, throw swim dig, throw spin boat, and uh, you'll absolutely have the best day. That's hypothetical if you could get out onto Albert's right now. <laughs> um, where would the fish position this time of the year? What do you think? Mm, I think you're still going to find those fish in the back of the bays. You'll find a couple of them on the, those main lake points. And uh, the river there always comes into play. Those fish either move in or out of that river on a constant basis, and you can find them schooling up there quite frequently. So that would be my first spot to head to. I'll go right in front of the vet's house up in the river section. Uh, let's talk a little bit about uh, PBs. What's your biggest bass, and where was it caught? So it's just over 11 and a half pounds, so 5.2 kilos. And uh, that was a fish that came from Let's Bojo in Botswana. Um, on, that was the second trip that we'd done there as the magazine. And uh, fishing under quite tough conditions. It was the end of July. And the fish had just started to move up. And I probably caught that fish in about two feet of water. So shallow. The dorsal fin must have been sticking out to something. <laughs> that quite an interesting story. The wind was blowing quite hard and there was one isolated stump and I'd missed a cast right at it and just left the bait and uh, the next thing it just took off with this giant on the end of it. So, But, but you also had a couple of other big ones there that uh, didn't land in the boat. They so I have. A bit bigger. The biggest fish I've ever hooked was there. Uh, I've never had a fish straight stick me on 30 pound fluoro and uh, not stop moving. That was the same day that it caught that five and broke me off like I was fishing with six pound line. Incredible. Well, I hope we can get out there again soon. But while we're here, let's talk a little bit about something else. Before Angler's platform um, was pretty much an idea that you fostered and did a lot of work with over the past two years. Um, just tell us a little bit more about Four Anglers and how it came about and why it is so relevant in today's day and age. So we've seen, especially in the media sphere, there's been a huge transition to digital media. So I think in our market, we've seen a lot of people adopt Facebook as a, a medium to access information from. And we've had a lot of requests for a platform where our readers, our magazine, our conventional magazine readers, uh, we're looking for a little bit more information, reference points, how to access previous content and uh, more frequent content as well. And that's where it all started out. So we've been going for 16 plus years now with a bank angler. And uh, that's a lot of content and information that was stored in magazines that no one had access to. Plus we have a lot of fresh content we generate on a, a daily basis. So this was the perfect home for it. And we could house all of our video, 
our how to master classes, our bake recipes, and the whole gambit of content that we've covered over the years, plus everything we produce on a monthly basis uh, for the magazine from our contributors out in the field is all home on for anglers. And it's pretty much the digital library, uh, encyclopedia, and uh, news point for everything fishing locally. What is, what is the difference between social media and digital media and the way that, that you use it at for anglers? So we have five different pages that we run in terms of our social media, including our Instagram account. And that's more of a place where our community interacts, we inform them of new happenings, what's happening on the site. Uh, and it's a very active news stream where our digital media platform has a great reference portal. So you can go reference any article, you get access to new content. And of course, all of that content you'll find uh, directly on Facebook as well. So we'll send you a link and you just click the link and you have direct access to the site from our Facebook pages. Um, but, but for Angus as a, as a digital media site then, how much history is there and what can you get out of that from a reference point of view going back? So as I mentioned, we're going on 16 years now. So we have just currently on the site and we're probably 70% through of our back catalog. We've got 1,500 articles combined. And uh, that probably gives you on Bank Angus specifically up until our, I think the only content we're still busy republishing again is from the first five years. So everything up until now is already on the site for you to reference. So it's a wealth of knowledge, carp angler. We have almost all the content from the past four years and tight lines we have the past three years worth of content on there. So if you think about it, it's a huge volume of information uh, that never expires. It never goes anywhere. It's always online. It's 24 seven and you can read it from your phone, your tablet or your PC at home. Maybe you can show us a little bit about, um, about the site, how to go about, how do I navigate and what do I find on there? Can you maybe share your screen or something? Okay. So, if you haven't seen it, for anglers is foranglers.co.za. And uh, as the name describes, it's only for anglers. You won't find golf, you won't find other news. This is just purely an angling based site uh, with a huge collection of content. So, in terms of navigation, for April, we've expedited a couple of updates. And the nice thing about it is you can reference content a lot quicker and a lot more easily in specific categories. I'll just start with bank angle. If you have a look, we start off with our magazine section, go straight into bait, any adventure stories, our monthly columns. We've recently added some feeder content that's uh, been going up on the site in the past two weeks. We've got an extensive amount of fishing tips, which is now categorized in your how to, your knots and rigs. So if you want to know any trace or rig, what's latest coming out from uh, the tackle world, any product reviews, and then we have our news section, readers catches. And if you're looking for something specific on a species, we've categorized that all quite nicely into carp, barbel, copper, mudfish and yellows. And then venues, that's one of our most popular section and uh, it's all very much easily accessible. So one key thing to note about our content, there's premium paid for content and then there's free content. Our Keep Fishing campaign that we launched just prior to lockdown is all part of our free content uh, that's available on the site and there's quite a few tips and uh, pieces that you'll find that are free but then there's two different tiering models that you have you can either be a basic member and get some access just purely to the magazine so if you want to read the digital e-edition of the magazine each month so if i, I just want to read the magazine on its own i don't i'm not interested in any other content um, i subscribe as a basic digital member Sure, you can. And then the magazine that you'll see. What will that cost me, Duncan? So that costs 29 Rand a month. And we've just made EFT payments available to monthly subscriptions. So if you'd like to sign up and you don't have a card, you can do an EFT and register via the site. We'll take you through the process. And then you have access to the magazine. I just need to log in. But will I also save money if I do it annually? You will. You save, 
I believe on our annual packages, you save 10%, uh, which is almost 80 Rand on the premium. And then on the others, you're saving 10% as well on a annual plan. So let's go back to the magazine so we can give you a demo of it. So just, th just thinking of it, uh, 29 Rand, and, and which magazines can I read and what, what will I have access to? So in terms of purely a magazine member or a digital e-edition basic member, you'll have access to the current latest issue of that publication. So be it Bank Angler, Carp Angler, Tight Lines. And then you'll have is access to 11 back issues. So the previous year on a rolling system. And uh, for premium members, they have unrestricted access to all three of them, and they have unrestricted access to all the back issues. Oh, all three of them. That means that if, if I subscribe to the magazine, I can read all three magazines for 29 Rand? No. You can only read one publication. So for your 29 Rand, you get uh, just a single publication. You get to choose between Bank Angle, Carp Angle, or Tight Lines. But if you're a premium member, which costs you 49 Rand a month, you have unrestricted access. Oh, okay. And let's have a look just how the magazine displays while that's loading. So we've added one or two new features in terms of how our e-reader functions. And uh, it now enables you to read the magazine as a conventional magazine with two pages and what we'll call a spread. So you can view two up. And there's a nice feature that we've added, especially for desktop viewers that you can scroll sideways so you don't actually ever have to zoom in and out if you're happy with your zoom level, especially in how a, a print PDF version functions online in a digital space. So there you see you have your entire access to the magazine. You can read all the content. And if I have a look. So it's almost like just paging through the magazine. Exactly the same experience. So. You can set if you want it onto even spreads, odd spreads. Generally, the magazine runs on even spreads. And then a function that I really like now is horizontal scrolling. So if I'm reading, I can read the page, then I simply scroll right. And it takes me to the next page just to read all the content. Okay, and I can zoom in and out. You can zoom in and out and you can use the zoom function as well on the menu bar. And if you're looking to reference anything specific, there is a nice content index. And you can just open up the content index and jump to any page that you'd like to. So it's all the same experience that you would have in the printed version, just in a digital format. And you can access that anytime, anywhere from your phone or from a tablet or a PC. Can I take it to the water? You can indeed. If there's enough signal where you are, you can log in anyway. Okay, now let's say I'm a, I'm a subscriber of the Digital Basic Package and uh, I see all these other nice things on the site. How do I go about to upgrade? Can I upgrade from being you a can basic um, digital member to a premium? You can indeed upgrade and we upgrade all of our members of basic members on a prorated rate. So if you are in the middle of the month and you choose to upgrade, you'll only pay for the remaining of the premium membership for that month. And then from the following month, you'll upgrade. So to go through the process on both mobile and digital, there's an account section and on that account section, all you have to do is select change my plan. So I'm currently a monthly member. I'll just show you the process. If we go through, I'm going to upgrade to an annual. Then I follow all the steps. I choose my payment method. I'm going to pay by EFT or by credit card. And when it says credit card, I just like to highlight that, Randy, that uh, the system says credit card, but you have access to pay via your debit card and check card and any of the Visa or MasterCard cards that enable online transactions. So you're not limited. If you don't have a credit card, you don't have to worry. You can still pay by card uh, with most of the modern cards and the pay by EFT option is also there available to you. On the card, then you just put in, on the card payment, is it safe to pay by card? Or? So we currently utilize as our payment gateway, we use PayFast, which is the largest e-commerce payment gateway in the country. So they employ the 
the best encryption standards and uh, best security standards. And uh, the experience, once you select pay by card and you complete your details, what happens on the site, it will open a new window on PayFast and it will either ask you to create an account there and you fill in all your details and complete it there. So our, our potential subscribers shouldn't be put off by being redirected to another site. PayFast is a secure payment provider and uh, they manage all of those details and we just interact directly with that payment gateway. On, on that PayFast platform, um, I see that there's, there's many other service providers that use PayFast as well. If I use PayFast and I register it here with for anglers, um, will I now have an account that I can use somewhere else as well? You do. You definitely have that account and it enables you. If you shop somewhere that uses PayFast as that gateway, your details will be already loaded and quite often your card details will be stored online by them and it enables very quick payments that you can make on other platforms. So I know Van, yourself, you run and uh, you take part in quite a couple of cycling events and uh, a lot of the event organizers use PayFast as theirs. So in your case, you can sign up on for anglers and uh, use those same details for quick payment processing on any of your cycling events, for example. Okay, that's great. And, and it's perfectly safe. All of that is encrypted and there's an authentication process. It is, and you get uh, a system that's called 3D Secure whereby it sends a one-time pin to your phone registered to that card that uh, then gives you access on the transaction. So it's a, on a per transaction basis and it only runs when you've authorized it. We do run on a monthly subscription basis where once you subscribe, all you do is fill in your details and uh, you can pretty much let the system administer the payment for you. So you take out of all that manual hassle of remembering, oh, I need to pay my EFT. You just let it run through and PayFast handles all of our subscriptions. So effectively, I only need to do it once and for the next 10 years, I don't have to worry about anything. Sure. If you're loving the service and uh, we're still delivering the same great content, or you, you can just let it run and not have to worry about that. Okay, if I'm not happy, what do I do? So on our uh, monthly model, our monthly uh, memberships. We have a no questions asked cancellation fee or cancellation policy and uh, your membership will run for what you've currently paid for. So you'll get the current membership that you've paid for and we cancel it, no questions asked. Okay, great. But I, but I know I won't, I won't cancel it because I'm not happy. I might cancel it because I stopped fishing or I immigrate to New Zealand. But, but if I immigrate, will I still be able to, to see this content? You will indeed. So we've got a couple of uh, members from Australia. There's a big carp angling fraternity that's busy growing in Australia. And we've recently had one or two from America as well. And we definitely have a few members from the UK as well that uh, specifically in the bank angling market can't get hold of that same kind of information. They don't get their favorite dips or dip combinations or how to source the best feed. So they're very much still involved in our platform. And uh, some of the European countries like Belgium and the Netherlands also have quite a bit of interest. Okay, great. And then if I have to pay by EFT? So if you pay by EFT on either a monthly or a annual payment, you simply fill in the details. It creates the account for you. And one key thing about it is it is on a renewal subscription base. So at, the end of the month, actually seven days before your subscription is about to lapse each month, you'll get a notification just to remind you. On the last day, you'll get another email reminder just to give you an update. And then if you do forget to make the EFT payment, the system automatically just suspends your account after three days. So there's no risk with EFT payments. If you want to hop on and hop off at any point in time, it's a very easy means to do it and you still have access to the content. That means if I've created my account and I pay it for this month and I forget to renew it at the end of the month and three days in, I can just do another EFT and be reactivated, is that right? That's correct. Okay, what is important about this process to close it out? In terms of the process, how you complete the process. EFT, so yeah. one thing, 
One thing that uh, I'd like all the, the potential members that are listening to remember, once you're completed on an EFT, if you select the EFT payment, the, you'll see that you're now provided with our account details on how to pay. And then what happens to process the order, you just need to hit the submit and check out button, which is very key. That's an important part, just hit submit and check out. It creates your order and as soon as we receive the funds, we activate your account and it will, all the content will become accessible immediately. One thing that is important here though, is that um, I have my reference right. I can't put in for Angus as a reference. No, so the reference is your FA for four anglers and your surname for that payment. Otherwise, if I just put four anglers, nobody knows where the funds come from. That's correct. It needs to correspond to the order for your account and that's how we are allocated. This program is made possible by Laurence. Get the Elite TI2 with wireless networking capability now and see what is lurking below. Okay, great. So now I'm, I'm a premium member. So what else can I get and what can I see? So we can start off quickly with the, the base features. I'm just going to link back again. As a premium member, you have access to absolutely everything on the site. So for our non-members who viewed the site, they might have in, encountered our paywall. That gives you the payment options if you were interested in reading a piece of content that was a members only piece of content and then it would give you an option to purchase a membership. So for our premium members, they have access to absolutely everything. We keep nothing behind and uh, we've even released a new competition that launched yesterday, which is some of our member exclusive competitions where they stand a chance as only members to win some really great prizes over the past month. All of our new members also stood a chance to win some of our uh, lockdown cleanup hampers, which I'm sure you guys would have seen on, on Facebook with some really great packages that yourself and Anna were administering. And uh, there's literally nothing as a premium member you don't have access to. So from the video sections to all the debates and tips uh, on the bank angling side, if you're a keen bank angler as a premium member, you get access to the Ask the Nick book as well which all three of them are on the site with all of our bait recipes dip combinations uh, and then on the magazine side you get all of the carp angler the tight lines bank angler we'll be adding a couple of uh, bass angler back issues from this week and then on bank angler we already have 2018's entire uh, back catalog already lined up to be launched tomorrow. So that's quite exciting in terms of, of the bank angling side and okay. on tight lines and carp angling bass will be rolling out similar. So this is pretty important. So if I'm a basic digital member that only reads the magazine, I can only see a year's back issues. But if I'm a, a premium member, I can see everything that goes back. That's correct. Okay. This is, this is quite a, uh, quite a busy menu and there's a lot of things. Um, and if I'm looking for something specifically, going through all these menus, it might take me some time. Is there a shortcut? So there definitely is. It is our search function, which is a live search function, as you'll see as I open up something and I'm going to look for, it's our example, Supercast. And then you see anything with reference to Supercast would come up as a content selection and you can simply just click through and read that article. So one key point when searching, it is spelling dependent. So if I combine the word, sometimes it doesn't quite find all the information you were looking for. Okay, if, if I put part, part of a word, let's say I wanna go fish at Rurekopis. Now Rurekopis can be spelled differently. So if I just put Rurekop, will it give me? Should indeed give you. Rude. Oh, okay, it will. There we go. And it's quick to access and you can view all the results in a more detailed manner. So for all the mentions, you can go through as it's mentioned anything regarding Reddit copy. So all the content oh, on the site. And, and it goes, I see it goes across. So it, it's not only bank angling or carp angling. If everything referred to Reddit copies, whether it comes from bass or carp or bank, it doesn't matter. That's correct. So it indexes everything that you need to know 
regarding that search phrase. So, and you can see it continues going into to different articles. So you might be able to explore content uh, that you necessarily didn't uh, engage with previously. And it's a nice way to find out information either on a venue, on a, a tip, a rig. And uh, the really great thing about Four Angers is we offer different perspectives and different way of doing things from a wide variety of anglers that are experts in their field and uh, it can give you a great idea if you were looking for example we have numerous pieces on the d-rig currently if you're a specimen angler and uh, you can see there's the slip d-rig the conventional d-rig and broken down by various perspectives which is really great and uh, Obviously, because D is or rig is in the word, it's going to list a lot of the rigs, but those kinds of things. So you can find a lot of information from different perspectives. And one thing I found as an angler is your way is not always the best way, and you can always learn something new. So even if you've read about a Texas rig briar or you've read about the, the rig flash throp, you might get a different application from a different angler. So it's really great to broaden your horizon as, a, as an angler. And the content that we generate is is really a high level. Can, can I search uh, per author? So I see Neville has done a few things. If I want to see everything that Neville or Gilbert has done. You can end with reference to them. And you'll see now it's indexing where Neville was the author or where Neville's featured. So either in our video content or directly in the issue of a magazine. Okay, to, talking about video, I, I also saw a, a TV section there. What does that mean? So we, we've launched our TV section, which is uh, all the latest content coming from our YouTube page. And you simply hit TV to access it. This for all of our free members, I call it, our non-members. If you'd like to see some really great uh, interviews, rig tips, some adventure content, you'll see this is where our uh, on the line content has been stored and currently there's 29 videos uploaded to our four anchors tv and you can simply just scroll down to which whichever one you want to watch you can watch them and uh i'll open one of the on the lines with neville just to give you an example as the video loads and uh one thing that uh, i'd encourage any of our free viewers watching our videos just to go and subscribe to our channel so you can do it right from our page you just click on the icon and you hit the subscribe button and when you're on youtube there will be all the latest updates of any content that we've put on and it's a really good experience watching video directly here is because you can hit full screen full screen the entire video okay or alternatively watch it like that and it works the entire site is what we call responsive. So it adapts to whatever device you're watching it on. So if you're on your, your PC at home, it will show it in the best possible format for your PC. If you're on your tablet, we'll optimize it for your tablet and on your mobile. It's the best for your mobile device. Okay, Duncan, I've got a specific question about the articles. Can we just go to any article that is there in the written format sure i know that there's also uh some video within some of the articles uh, maybe some of the feeder articles okay then we'll just go down i'll show you how to navigate get to feeder and as soon as you click on any of our categories it's going to combine all of that category's content into one page so let's open up part six the technicality of the feeder Okay, now if I like the article and I want to share it with my friends, uh, how does that work? Or if I have got a comment on it? So interesting that you ask. We've just added commenting, um, which are at the bottom of, of our articles on select articles. And comments are open to all of our paying members. So unfortunately for our free members, they don't have access to comment, but they can read all the comments. 
which we're going to encourage our members to take part in and they will get quite a bit of uh, great insight and uh, response either from the author or from any of our four anglers team uh, will answer on of, of those questions. And when you ask how do I share, uh, at the top of every article, there's a social share section and you can either share via Facebook, Twitter, Skype and via email. And if you're on a mobile device, you can share via WhatsApp. So you'll see the little green icon for WhatsApp. You just click on that, it will share it straight to someone, any of your friends or family or your fellow anglers that you want to share that specific article with. Now, if it, if it is a free article um, and I share it, everybody can see it. But if it's a paid for article um, and I share it with somebody that's not a member. Then the experience they will have is similar to this. This is basically what a free article looks like, just to give you guys an idea. And uh, we do carry some advertising as well. So we get some support from our, our advertisers in the industry and it would be great if uh, you guys could go out and support them as well. They're what make this possible. Um, and, uh, sorry, sorry to interrupt you. I just want to ask, uh, just go back to the, to the advertiser. Um, if, if I see an advert and I'm interested, in the content on the advert. How do I engage with that, um, that advertiser? So you simply, on most of our ads, there's just simply click and it will take you to the destination to find out more info. So I can either go to their Facebook or their website or something like that. That's correct. So if we have a look at, I'm just gonna go get us a, a paid for content piece. So now if you are a non-member and you log in, and as you mentioned, how would I, what would the experience be if you shared an article for someone who isn't logged in? So they'll get the title and they'll get a short snip of content. And then we encourage our, our readers to become members so that they do have access to the content. And that's the only way that you do have access, uh, unfortunately. I've had a few questions whether or not if one person buys a, a membership or signs up as a member, can they share it with all their friends and family? And unfortunately not. Um, we only access two devices simultaneously on it. So you can share it with your, with your husband or your wife or your partner and uh, they'll have access. But if both of you are at the same time, it will kick one of you off. Okay. I, I, can, I can load it on two different devices though. You can indeed. You can log in via your PC and have it on your phone at the same time. But but if I if I give my password and uh, login details to a friend, it will kick me off as well the moment they go in. That's correct. Yeah. Okay. Okay. But I mean, at at forty nine rand a month, it's really nothing. It's a, same as a uh, one bottle of dip or one which is less than a lure. Correct. And. Uh... There's so much value that you have access to. We really have a great team of contributors and even of the our anglers that have contributed over the years, a lot of that information is built up from countless hours and preparation on the water, which for anglers would probably be the best way to fast track your fishing in South Africa. I understand that there's a lot of YouTube videos out there and, uh, there's a lot of great content people are generating, but if you're looking for truly South African content, there's no other home for it. And the insights that you will garner, for example, fishing ready copies dam, we have Gilbert is one of the experts there. And to figure out how to catch those fish in a very condensed manner bank. If you think of for anglers, it's not just a place where I can go read content. It's how I can improve my skills, how I can fast track what's happening at a water how I can catch those bigger fish if I'm after them from with very specific detailed techniques and strategies. So that's one of the greatest benefits. And that's what I love about for anglers. There is a wealth of knowledge that an angler who might be relatively inexperienced within a year could become an expert. If I'm a member of uh, for anglers without having to go back there all the time, how do I know that there's new content? So every day we have a, update newsletter that goes out to our members and to our entire newsletter database of subscribers. 
and it publishes the latest content. And when you sign up, you actually have the option to segment where do you want to, what newsletter you'd like to receive. We run one for, for bank angling, carp angling, one specifically for tight lines, adventure angling, and then another one for bass angling. And you can subscribe to any of those. Or if you're a paid member, you don't have to worry about subscribing to any of them. You'll already receive a daily update. And for those guys who like to interact on Facebook, all of the content that we publish goes directly to any of our relevant Facebook pages. But if you want to find absolutely everything, you can follow us on Facebook at Four Anglers. Last question to you is, if, if I'm a carp angler or a bass angler, um, is how do I get my experience to be tailored towards my field of uh, of interest and not getting bogged down with other content? So we've separated all four of our main content categories, and all they are bank angling, carp angling, tight lines, and bass angler, and each of them have their very own homepage. So when we initially launched for anglers, we didn't want to dilute any of our, our current very strong angling brands and the, the publications that we ran behind them. And I'll take you to Bank Angler, for example, is a really great resource on bank angling and only the content in this category relates to bank angling. So you'll have what's in our latest issues, all the latest tips and uh, bait tips, a bit of adventure fishing, and the latest videos that are bank angling related and then fishing tips. So they each house their own very own section of content and the home page, if you think about it, has all the content that you'd want access to. And if you were looking for something more specific, you can just bookmark any of those main pages. Okay. So so if I'm if I'm reading um and I've gone through the menus and I find something that's interesting and may, maybe it's a little bit too long and I want to save it to come back to later. How do I do that? Can I? You can if you're a, a logged in user or paying member. I'm just going to switch my screen again. If you want to reference this article on a, at a later stage, uh, we introduced favorites quite a while back. And when you get to the end of the article, You'll notice there's an add to favorites section. If you simply hit that button, add to favorites, it'll now store that in your own favorites library. And to access your library of favorites, you go to your own account settings and just click on the favorites menu item. And there you see it displays in your favorites. And you have no limit to how many articles that you can store for quick reference. And if you ever get tired of an article or you want to Remove it, you just go straight back to it. Scroll down to the bottom of the article, like we just did where we signed it up, and you remove it from your favorites. So it's a really nice way to keep a library of your own content. Something that we touched on, but we never showed it to the viewers is, uh, how do I leave a comment? Let's go leave a, a comment as a logged in user. If you scroll all the way down, past all of the, the referral content, what else you can read, because there's just so much to read. You can go down and join the discussion on any post and leave a reply. So for a logged in user, you simply type in your reply, you post the comment and it will appear here. And what you can do, you can subscribe to those comment lists. So if it was a very hotly debated topic or something you'd like to find more information on, you just hit the subscribe button and you can get notifications. It should be delivered to you via email. Okay, which means that if anybody um, goes and comment on that specific article, I will get a notification. That's correct. Okay. So it's a nice way to track. So it's a feature we've just introduced this week and you'll see a lot more commenting areas available on our premium content and even on some of our free features as well. Last question, what can I win? What can you win? So there's quite a couple of prizes in our win section that are published on either weekly or monthly basis. And uh, we just launched one yesterday in our win section, which is a members only competition. So if you sign up in the month of April and May, you stand a chance to win a Akuma LS6K bait feeder 
and a sensation velocity next gen combo as an example is one of the great prizes you can win you can also then if you sign up within our lockdown period you can win any of our lockdown specific hampers which is really great so sign up for an annual membership and then you can win them we're going to be rolling out a new competition in the next few days where you can win a membership for a friend so if you sign up for an annual membership you go into the draw daily and we'll be offering any of those winners a free subscription to give away to one of their friends uh, family member angling partner so they can enjoy for anglers as well so you guys can think of it if you win it's a two for one deal okay so if i subscribe today i can either win i can either win the big prize for that two days or i can win the big prize for the week or i can win a subscription for my friend and then if i go into as a member i can have an exclusive member um, prize that i can win or any of the other prizes running on the side that's correct so it's, enter, just, enter. it's just win 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 all the all the way Win. It is a win situation with uh, for anglers. You get great content, you get great prizes, and uh, as we go on through the year, we're going to be adding quite a few more competitions. We've got some really great prize uh, sponsor partners in Sensation Anglic Supplies, Supercast, uh, Adrenaline, Kingfisher. So the whole gambit of uh, all the latest and greatest tackle we will be giving away and giving you some early access to as well, which is, which is a great benefit of being a member of Wanglers. Um, Duncan, thank you very much. Thank you for, um, for talking to us. We really appreciate uh, your time and uh, good luck with the development. And uh, may the years to come be greater and greater in terms of uh, expanding this platform to be of great value to everybody that is involved with it. Thank you. Yes, it's it's really exciting for us on on the back end side and to see how it's developed. And we've had such a phenomenal month so far in terms of engagement with the site. And particularly, want to say thank you to all of our, our members who have signed up this month and who are supporting us as a a content developer or a content generator in South Africa. So really, a big thank you to everyone who's already signed up. If you haven't signed up. I encourage you to go at least have a look at the site, check out what it's all about and uh, experience it for yourself. Either even if you just go watch the videos or read one or two of our free articles. Thank you very much. And to our viewers, thank you for joining us. And just remember, you are awesome.